graphic nature of this program, listener discretion is advised. Hey Holly, what's the matter? Nothing Tom, I'm just contemplating. Do you always have to contemplate? Tom, can you not? Look, I always knew you wanted to say something when you contemplate. It's okay to speak to me. Fine. It's about Kelly and Emma. They came up to me during lunch period yesterday, disgruntled. Oh, did they get into a whiz -bitch fight with the gossip girls again? No, some guy named Zach talked smack to them. I know Zach. He was my friend for a few years. What's gone into him? I don't know, honey. All I know is that it happened out of nowhere. They said he blamed them for getting him grounded. Not cool. I'm gonna talk to him at school tomorrow and find out what happened. It's not worth it, Tom. He is kind of suspicious for my taste. You felt the same way about me when we first met. It is not in his character to blast out at people, even at girls. Okay, okay. I won't stop you from trying to salvage this situation. Can we finish eating, please? Shit. Two full days and they did not come back to flirt with me. I got to get over this. Hey, uh, oh hey Tom, anything you need? Care to explain yourself? About what? Wait, are you referring to those two girls? Do not try to apologize, I didn't mean to do it. My girlfriend thought otherwise, man. Zach, between us, those girls were some of my friends. Wait, they were? Since when? Since we went to school in year 8. Great, you've just made me feel even more bad about it. Tom, for you to double down on these matters just does not help any. I'm not trying to double down on this. I want answers. Why did you act this way? It's my dad. He told me not to speak with him while grounded. I got so upset by this. It felt as if he was forcing me not to do something at all. Jesus and I thought my dad was that harsh. Then again man it doesn't excuse my behavior. I could have handled this better but I feel it is far too late now. Dude, there's always hope. Maybe they will come back and you'll get your chance. Not sure if that is entirely reassuring. Not sure either, regardless. Sorry if I got a little pushy. You're good Tom. That is what he told me Holly. It is all kinds of messed up. You have to be joking. Using his dad is not an excuse to justify his behavior, at all. Actually, he admitted what he did was inexcusable. Can I ask what you are trying to imply? It could all be a ploy, Tom. Zach was known for being troublesome anyhow. So were we, Holly. For all we know his dad could be an emotional abuser. Damn can't argue there. I met Diesel before. He was quite a mad guy in his own right. Yeah, I thought so too. My suggestion, talk to Kelly and Demi a little, probably provide them a little insight. I personally would let things like this flow naturally but Emma especially would not be entirely forgiving to mean boys, so, I'll talk to them. Well that's settled then, I am gonna go see if Zach is out of detention, and possibly take him home with his sister, I'll catch you tomorrow morning. Okay Tom, see ya. Okay, the couple finally got back together. The notebook is amazing. Yeah, I agree. Same. At some point in our lives we may find someone like Noah Calhoun, and come back with him whenever the timing is right. Holly you know I hardly have any time with boys, at least not now anyway. I know, just being optimistic, seeing as I have Tom with me at all times. Yeah I don't waste too much on boys either. I certainly don't want Zach to come near us again that I can say. You're still on about that Kelly? Never thought you had a grudge on him. Yes, R.A. He isn't worth my time. Hey, take Fred out like I suggested he still digs you. I'd rather keep him in the friend zone, not my type of eye for dating. Oh, come on, he is worthy. Honestly, she's kinda right. Fred's a little too on the nose. Can say it better than you, Holly. Do you always soil my suggestions? Actually, I was pushing it to the side. Just as bad. What are you trying to say? I already did tell you how badly it went for me and Tom one time, don't you remember? He smack talked to me before, it upset me yes, but even he admitted that he never meant to. 
Yeah, you told us that before. Didn't Tom get it set over some stupid accident? Yeah, the point is, sometimes it is worth looking at the person inside. If Tom and I can come to terms, maybe you all will with Zack. I never thought of that. But Zack and Tom are not alike. True, but they're good friends. Even he knows what is up with him. Gonna go get an apple of the table. Be right back. I think she may not be wrong, Emma. Fred went through much in real life as well. Me and Zach never meant to talk bad at us. I doubt that is the case. So much to think about. I hear you. Let's give this more a time and we will talk to him then. How does that sound? Um, I guess. All nice to see gals settling on discussions. Don't mind me just enjoying the honey crust. Hey. It's Go Multiverse Legacy 394, also known as the Fun Editor 4, and I thank you all for watching the video. If you want to see more of my content, smash the like button, ring the bell for notifications, subscribe, and share this video out there. And be sure to check out all the content that is on the channel, along with the two videos which are provided. I'll see you guys on the other side.